Ever wondered how stillmakers create that soft, dreamy glow in their shots? The cinematic magic that makes everything seem like a dream. So today, I'm about to teach you how to bring that to life directly inside Adobe Premiere Pro. No plugins, there are no insane configurations, just pure and simple editing shine. So buckle up because by the end of this tutorial, your footage is gonna look like it's a step straight out of a dream sequence. Hey what's up guys, I'm Shabit. If you love insane high quality tutorials like this one, make sure to smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on the next mind blowing edit. So once you have got your clip in your timeline that you want to apply the bloom effect on, the first thing we will do is hold alt on your keyboard and drag it one layer up to create a second duplicate of your clip. You might say that I don't have just one clip, I have a lot of clips in my timeline and I want to apply the bloom effect for them all. What should I do? In that case, select all of your clips, right click and select nest. Then name your nest and press ok. Then duplicate the clip by holding down the alt key and dragging up. Now head to effects panel and if you don't see it, go to window and select effects. Then search for luma key and drag it onto your duplicated layer. Then return to effects panel and search for gaussian blur. And add it to the duplicated layer. Go to Fix Control Panel and set the blurriness to 250. What Gaussian Blur does is soften the luminosity of your clip. Now duplicate the Gaussian Blur by selecting it and hitting Ctrl C to copy and Ctrl V to paste. And change the blur dimensions to horizontal. Now adjust the opacity to get the desired look. I like to go with 50%. Next go to Fix Panel and search for Noise. And drag it to your first layer. Then in the effects control panel, change the amount of noise between 10 to 20. And here is a sneak peek of the final results we'll achieve. Got any questions? Drop them in the comment section and I will do my best to help you out. Don't forget to subscribe for more wonderful tutorials and hit the bell icon to be updated on new tutorials. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.